Doctors at a Toronto hospital have performed an operation to repair a serious spinal abnormality before the patient was even born. For baby Iko, it was a remarkable step on a long journey, which began with a pretty terrifying diagnosis. Finding out something was wrong with our little baby is probably every pregnant mother's worst nightmare. Our doctor told us that this meant our beautiful baby girl would be expected to have brain damage, probably be in a wheelchair for life, and, and diapers um, as well, that she'd be incontinent. We were devastated. The diagnosis was spina bifida, a congenital condition that, as you just heard, can change your life forever, both quality of life and life expectancy. Worldwide, one out of every 1,200 babies is born with spina bifida. It's less common than it once was, but it's still the number one disabling birth defect in Canada. On average, about 120 babies are born with it every year. But there may be new hope. Romela San's daughter underwent in utero surgery to repair her spine back in June at about 25 weeks gestation. The procedure has been available in the United States for some time, but it was the first time it had been attempted at a Canadian hospital. It took 24 doctors two and a half hours to perform the delicate operation. Spina bifida is a condition where the spinal cord protrudes from the back. Surgeons had to oh so carefully repair the opening and then ensure the mother didn't go into premature labor. Baby Iko arrived nearly two months later. Does that mean she's, she's doing amazing? So um, her back is healed quite nicely. Um, her legs are kicking. She's got feeling down to her toes. She's eating well, she's sleeping well. And Baby Iko will likely still have some remaining effects from her condition, but the operation has been deemed a resounding success.